thank you all for being here. Thank you, Dave. Um, as, as someone else mentioned, um, candidates go out and knock on a zillion doors. It's wonderful when we have one night where we see so many people. This is wonderful. Um, I'm Paul Bombach. I'm running for state representative in the 23rd district. We have a primary amongst the Democratic Party candidates on September 11th. I'm looking for your vote. Uh, I went to the University of Delaware in 1979 and 1983, got a degree, and also met my wife. We celebrate 27 years on Saturday, um, and so I'm pretty very excited. Uh, we, we moved to uh, Western Pennsylvania and then D.C. We came back to Newark in 1990. Uh, we've raised our family here. Um, I started my business in 1996 on Main Street in Newark, Vance Funk's building. We're now on Barksdale Road. I'm a financial planner. I help people with their retirement. Uh, making sure they can retire with confidence. Um, but I think the other thing that's important for this race is I know numbers. I can work numbers. And at Dover, most of the important things have uh, numbers attached to it. And I think we need to make sure that we're doing that with confidence. And that's what I do for my clients, and that's what I'll do for you as your representative. I'm very committed to the community. I serve on the board of the Newark Housing Authority, as appointed by Governor Mark Powell. We're working on redeveloping the property on Clinton as Cleveland Heights near Porter Chevrolet. We want to make sure we have quality homes for our low-income neighbors. Um, I teach through Delaware Money School since its inception in 1999. I was just voted favorite teacher. Really happy about that. Uh, I'm really dedicated to use my skills to help our community. Uh, I'm a leader in our, our congregation, Social Justice Committee. I've led it for seven years. Uh, we've done a lot of good programs, including um, opening our doors on cold winter nights to those without shelter. Um, I've also worked against bad development. You guys have right now, not far from here, a proposed bad development where they're asking for a zoning um, change that just isn't justified. Um, and we need to stand strong against that. I've done that in the past. I do that presently, and I'll be doing that in the future for you. One of our slogans is moving forward and giving back. What I've mentioned before is some of the ways I've been giving back. But I think this, the moving forward talks about what we do today, are we going to accept the status quo, or are we going to move forward and make things better? And I think we need to move um, things forward and make them better. The, um, there, there's a lot of ways that Delaware can be even better. I think Delaware is great. I love it here. I've lived here for so long. Um, but I think we can make it even better. One of the things I think that our state representatives need to do is stand up for those without a large voice. And there's ways that I've done that and ways I want to continue to do that, and that's how we can move our state forward. Um, I've worked successfully on the Freedom of Information Act, applying it to the General Assembly. For years, the General Assembly was exempt. We, need to, we needed to fix that. We worked years on it because it's important, and we got that and we were successful there. We've done the same thing on the mandatory minimum sentences for minor drug offenses, giving the judges the discretion they need to properly um, apply the right uh, judgment uh, to, to someone with a minor drug offense. And we also worked, and it took many, many years to end the discrimination they can only discriminate based on sexual orientation. Um, that took a lot of time, and Dave Sapol was one of the leaders on that, but it took a lot of years to move our state forward. Um, part of, because of my work on that, which I, I was involved for many of those years, um, I'm the, the only candidate endorsed by the Barbara Giddings Delaware Stonewall Democrats, and that's a reflection of both what I've done, what I am doing, and what I'm committed to continue to do. Uh, the other major endorsement, I'm the only candidate with the endorsement of the Delaware Democratic Party. Again, based on what we have done and, and what I'm committed to continue to do. I talk about one of the bills I'm most happy with this year was the payday lending bill. I'm pleased with it because it was the, it was really led by Helene Keeley, a liberal Democrat from Wilmington, and Colin Benetti, a conservative Republican downstate. They worked together because this is important. They knew they had to do this to make to bring Delaware forward. These two people with their passion were able to bring the rest of the legislators together. That's what I want to do down in Dover for you. Build these alliances on the important things in Delaware and bring them forward and make our state better. To do that, I'm going to need your vote on September 11th. Um, I think I'm running towards it, being out of time. Uh, we have a meet and greet uh, next Tuesday uh, at the Lanter um, at, at uh, Russell Elizabeth Murray's home. I'll be here afterwards. Our website, paulbombach.com, has lots of information. Um, I have knocked on every door in this neighborhood, I believe. And I'll be back a little bit more, uh, a few more doors. Three minutes to go? 30 seconds. Three seconds to go. Okay. Um, I'm committed to moving our district and our state forward, but I need your help. I need your vote. Thank you for being here today. I welcome your questions. 